as a last example, let's say you want to be able to play three groups at once, but you still want to adjust individual volumes. For this, we need three menus that we will prepare now. We head over to the menu selection that we did earlier, where we already entered the, the uh, group names. And what we're going to do now is we save this three times with a different action pre-assigned. And this is the so-called playback group A. The only thing that we do now is we change this to B, save this within a different name, call it B, and the same for C. So that we have three different menus. Once again, we need to add pictures so that these text files appear as items in the KGM library. Just make duplicates. There we go. Let's go over to KGM, reload the user folder, and there you can see we drag them in. Oh, yeah, not A. Of course, A, B, and C. Like this. One thing that we have to do now is we need to turn off again the multi sample mode because otherwise the instrument would play all instruments at once, but we only want to play three at once. We set that back to zero. We save this. And there's now one more thing that we need. We need switches to turn on these groups individually. Let's go to switches and choose any switch that you like. Let's add a quick label with a double click. Just for the sake of demonstration so that everybody knows what this button does. And another one. Now we need to assign the group enable actions to these buttons. These are in these are in miscellaneous. We choose group A active toggle. For this one we to choose B and C. And this way you can easily mix and match different groups. <laughs> 